Hey what's up guys my name is Benji and recently I made a break from competitive CSGO and started surfing a bit more in my free time cause I was sick getting unbalanced team in my matchmaking. So today I decided to start a new series on my channel and I'm going to try to upload one video every week where I'm gonna show you how to complete some surf maps. Now have in mind that I'm not really great surfer and these tips and videos are mainly uh, for completing the level so that means that they are 90% for the beginners and maybe in the future if I get better at surfing I'll make some advanced map guides but today I'm bringing you guide how to complete surf Mesa one of the most popular maps out there and I hope you will enjoy this video and don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to my channel if you're new so let's start so let's jump to the first ramp and just by holding opposite key you should be doing this really easy and this first jump is really easy and the first problem comes here so let's stop. Now usually a lot of you guys beginners and even I failed here so many times uh, because uh, I didn't know at what uh, speed and what height should I leave this ramp to get the perfect so usually either I don't have enough speed and he, uh, hit the ground under the ramp or I have too much speed and hit the uh, wall over the ramp so usually what I suggest you here is you have these squares and I will show you on the video I'll put arrow usually I exit this ramp around four uh, row from uh, bottom of the ramp and you should also uh, leave it like there because that's the like perfect height and you will get perfect speed to approach the next ramp now next few ramps here as you can see on the video are really really easy nothing special you just surf on them and get speed and the second trick comes here now on this ramp usually uh, all of the guides are saying like stick to the ramp till the end so you get enough speed but if you stick to the end here you will have too much speed and you will hit the wall and what I did mistake and many of you maybe did it you leave at uh, the end of this ramp and you are doing some crazy 360 rotations but what's better is that you leave this ramp like here uh, earlier so you have the perfect angle to approach the next ramp and also uh, enough speed to uh, to complete the next jump which is a little bit longer now everything else is really really easy you should do it without any effort but the second tricky part is coming here when you are leaving the last ramp before the big jump now here you should get enough speed to do this jump because this will be long and let's stop here. Now here usually I exit the ramp on the third row from the bottom between third and fourth but usually I get it on the third because that's the perfect height for me on uh, to complete this jump and you will need a lot of speed to, uh, to complete this jump because you will see in the moment. So once you leave at the third row from this ramp you go to the one of these corners and start strafing on the opposite side and you will I think you will make it if you have enough speed but basically that's it that's the last uh, tricky jump now you will have this uh, boost on this ramp and you will complete the level really easily now some of you might fail here because if you flick uh, too much you will hit the roof or if you don't have enough speed uh, you will uh, be in the lab and you will burn obviously but basically that's the short guide how to do this I explained few trick, uh, trick places uh, and I gave you some tips and I hope uh, this will help you to complete this level like always guys hit the like button down below it helps a lot and leave a comment and like always bye and have a nice day hey guys and thank you for watching this video and if you enjoy it don't forget to hit that like button down below and leave a comment if you want to see more videos on my channel click some of the following annotations on the screen